Hello everyone, I am Rama. In this video, I am going to show you how to get number of iterations for Jacobi method in FX 991S calculator. Suppose the iteration formula for Jacobi method for some linear system is taken like this. Now here there are four unknowns x1, x2, x3, x4. It's very clear from this if k is changing on right side of each equation then we are going to get the successive iterations for all the unknowns x1, x2, x3, x4. So before going to get a sequence of approximations we need to take an initial guess for all the four unknowns. Let the initial guess be x10 equals to 0 0.2, x20 equals to 0 0.3, x30 equals to 0, x40 equals to 0 0.1. Now we are going to generate a sequence of approximations in our calculator. So all the unknowns x1, x2, x3, x4 can be assigned by the letters a, b, c, d in our calculator. We can see the letters here in this row okay uh, we can see all these variables are in pink color so if we want to get variable a then we have to use alpha and then this button so i, I just show you how to enter the equations let us enter the right side part or hs of each equation from the iteration formula so let us first enter 1 by 4 of x2 plus x3 for x2 x3 we are assigning the variables b c so i need to enter the first equation as one by four into x two is b b is here so i need to enter alpha and then b plus c alpha c brackets closed now i need to show the separation by the colon colon is also in pink color so let us type alpha integration symbol first equation is been entered here now the second equation rhs of second equation is to be entered that is 1 by 4 of x1 plus x4 our x1 is a x4 is d so i need to enter this as 1 by 4 into x1 is a alpha a open 1 by 4 of a plus x4 is d alpha d brackets closed second equation or hs of second equation is also been entered now separate for the separation use colon now go to the third equation from the iteration formula or hs part of third equation is 1 by 4 of one plus x1 plus x4 nothing but a plus d a plus alpha d brackets closed again there is a separation go to the last equation which is 1 by 4 of 1 plus x2 plus x3 so let us type 1 by 4 1 plus 
x2 x3 nothing but bc so which is b plus c alpha b plus alpha c we have entered the rhs part of each equation from the iteration formula in the calculator now we need to start finding successive iterations using the initial guess let us start finding so after entering rhs part of each equation we need to choose calc button and then it is asking for b b is assigned for the variable x2 x2 value is taken as 0.3 that we need to enter here 0.3 that we can see here something can be seen at the bottom part ignore that so after entering 0.3 we have to press equal to button then it will be asking for c value c is assigned for x3 x3 is taken as 0 let us enter zero value here and then press equal to then it is asking for a a is nothing but x1 x1 is 0 0.2 let us enter that value and press equal to and asking for d d is nothing but x4 which is 0 0.1 let us enter that value here and then press equal to then we can see something here 3 by 40 that is the value of our first variable x1 that is 0 0.075 that we need to note down as the first iteration of x1 0 0.075 and again press equal to button then we can see some other value that is the value of x2 again it is 3 by 40 nothing but 0 0.075 again press equal to then we get next variable that is x3 which is 13 by 40 convert this to decimal which is 0 0.325 and again press equal to then we get the value of last unknown it is again 0 0.325 we have got first iterations for all the variables x1 to x4 now using this first iteration values we have to generate second iteration values for which again we need to start giving the values for these unknowns for which again we will press equal to button then it will be asking for b value b nothing but x2 x2 is being obtained as 0 0.075 let us enter that value and immediately press equal to button then it is asking for c c is nothing but x3 which is 0 0.325 let us enter that value here and press equal to it is asking for a a is our x1 0 0.075 again press equal to it is asking for d d is nothing but x4 which is 0 0.325 we have entered first iterations of all unknowns now now we can press equal to button for multiple times and we note down the values for unknowns in sequence from x1 to x4 let us press equal to button then we can see something on the display which is 1 by 10 convert this to decimal which is 0 0.1 it is the second iteration of x1 again press equal to we are getting 1 by 10 which is the second iteration of x2 and again press equal to we got the value 0 0.35 second iteration of x3 again press equal to we get the value of last unknown which is 0 0.35 again we can use these second iterations to generate third iteration values for which press equal to it is asking for b again press equal to it is asking for c enter that value and press equal to it is asking for a enter that value and press equal to it is asking for d enter that value and press equal to now we can note down the values for the next iterations we continue the same process we proceed this till two successive iterations are same up to the desired accuracy i hope you understood this thank you